All right, my beautiful system thing here. Beautiful people. How's everybody doing today? On Friday, it is October the 26th. And same setting, I'm doing a couple of more VRs today. And I'm smoking out of my Meerschaum pipe. And in it, I have some Samuel Sam Galdwith 2011 Full Virginia Flake by none other than Berg. The Berg. Good people. Those of you who may not know of Josh or his channel, The Bearded Assassins, I'll leave it in the basement. He's got a beard that hell wouldn't have. Well, I'm telling you, that, that sucker is just big and bold, and he makes some stuff to put in it. Unfortunately, I can't use it. You can make some stuff to grow a beard. I'll buy all you can make. 50 something years old, I still got a lot of boy in me. Watching that dog and my wife. He's a watchdog. In fact, told y'all last time he watched somebody. Still some Christmas decorations off our porch last year. Good dog, good boy. I'm gonna be answering some of your questions, Josh. Let's see if we can get old Crosby into winning something, a little, little something, something. What is my favorite type of tobacco and why? Well, I wrote down Virginia, Burleys. I like aromatics. I like the flavors and how they complement each other. I like, uh, what is that that I put, uh, like when smoking air and more? Oh, that's good. I like that air and more. Boswell's Dan's Tobacco, Dan Tobacco. The sweetness reminds me of, uh, of uh, I guess, kind of like a, a little citrus type rind I guess if you will uh, got a little, little little bread in it or something man it's kind of got a I don't know I just like that type of uh, I like that type of smoke also the vanilla note uh, you pick up Java if you've never tried that it's good that, that's a real good uh, blend. Uh, you wanted to know when I started smoking a pipe. I started smoking last year, actually. About a little over a year ago. Yeah, about a little over a year ago. In fact, uh, Tennessee Bull had sent me a pipe. It's too daggone pretty. I, I put it upstairs and uh, too pretty to smoke. Can I say that? Then um, Hot Wings 326 had sent me a cob and some tobaccos. And I knew I should have bought a freaking lighter. God dang. And uh, yeah, and man, it wasn't long after that I lit that thing up. And started, uh, started smoking it. Mm -hmm. I like it. And I, I smoke pipes a lot when I'm driving. Uh, can't necessarily uh, do any video on that, but uh, most of the time on the way home from work I do a lot of pipe smoking. Number three, did anyone influence you to start smoking and why did you start? I wasn't influenced per se. When I joined this great community I started my channel off as Cigar Smoking Channel. I was aiming to do cigar reviews and uh, and I think it was Sean with Ghost Cop was uh, he was early on uh, some of my early on subscribers but he did a shout out and then after he did a shout out people started subscribing to my channel then I subbed them and started watching their content and then noticed that there was a lot of pipe smokers and pipes, uh, cigar smokers out there that being said, uh, 
the uh, they just welcomed me into the community and uh, man I would look and they would do tobacco reviews, pipe reviews, and some of the most beautiful pipes I'd ever seen in my life. And uh, even gifted some, to be real with you. But uh, I, again, I wasn't influenced. Uh, I did want to know what it tasted like. And uh, Abernathy Pipe Dream, I think, is the first pipe tobacco I smoked from John uh, Hot Wings 326. And, Man, it was good, and so from then on, it was, hell, I'd be on the phone with him or Boxer or whatever it is and asking about, you know, how do I tamp, how do I do this, how do I clean it, stuff. He was a big, a big supporter. So that was it, and, uh, yeah. So, well, I won't keep you. I'm going to probably jones a little bit more because my freaking lighters out. I can't keep a lighter. That's just what it is. Well, Josh, you take care, man. Congratulations on your subs and uh, everybody else. I appreciate y'all stopping in at Crosby's Corner. It certainly means a lot. It really does. And uh, y'all take care. Stay safe. God bless and we will see you soon.